They're often pacing an excellent start with eight horses driving from the gate. In between horses under a powerhouse whip is by popular demand. On the outside, Shannon Brooks along the rail, Annie Rapp. They're just battling up top for the lead, and Shannon Brooks is fastest of all. Annie Rapp holds on the inside, second hung on the outside, third by popular demand. R.H. Joyle neatly found a spot on the rail in fourth. Coming away fifth is Blue Ore, then a length and a half back to sixth finds Champagne Pike. They went by the quarter in 28 and 3. And your leader now by popular demand racing second is Shannon Brooks. Two lanes back to Annie Rapp, third up on the outside. Here comes Champagne Bike Pike moving up fourth. Right behind him, fifth is Test of Wits. R.A. Joyle now getting shuffled sixth, third over on the outside, seven C U Eater. Blue Ore has been shuffled the last. They move to the half mile pole in 59 and 1, and Champagne Pike moves up on the outside to challenge by popular demand for the lead. Shannon Brooks tucked in along the rail, third on the outside, Test of Woods fourth, and he's two and a half from the leader. Annie Rapp along the rail, fifth on the outside, six C U Eater. He still needs to make up five lengths. R.H. Joyle, no place to go on the rail. Blue Ore trails. Round the far turn by popular demand leads ahead. Champagne Pike hanging out there second. Shannon Brooks just begging for racing room. Brent Holland just sitting chilly, rating the tip test of wits out for the drive. And here they come. And right behind him, see you later. Around the turn, they're in the stretch by popular demand on a short lead. Test of which rolling up on the outside second. Champagne Pike can do no more. A late move on the outside by Blue Ore, and he's quickly passing horses. Test of which gets the lead. Blue Ore closing on the outside, on the inside by popular demand. Test of Wits in front, Blue Ore second. Shannon Brooks came on to be third by popular demand, fourth to complete the Superfect. In Balmoral's 10th race, number one, Test of Wits is your unofficial winner. It's a photograph for second. Please hold all tickets. Let's go to Maywood. Ladies and gentlemen, we are seven minutes away from race number 10 here at Maywood. Perfecta and the $1 Superfecta on this race. Field of eight, there are no changes. Now seven minutes. Going into the winner's circle will be one test of which. Test of which is owned by George and Julia Thomas, Homewood, Illinois, Harold Brightwell Trains, Brent Holland, the winning driver. Two wins tonight for driver Brent Holland. In the photograph two, Blue R finished second. Number five, Shannon Brooks finished third and four by popular demand fourth. Perfecta one two, Superfecta one two five four. Tenth race is official. The winner test of wits, a track program selection by Quick Cash and Kelly's Corner. Tenth race official, Perfecta 1 2, $59.40. 1 2, Perfecta 59.40. The Superfecta 1 2, 5 4, $795.10. 1 2, 5 4 on the Superfecta, $795.10.